able to get away. I'll be thinking of all of you, and I know you'll have a lot of fun remembering. It was fun for me to look at the class picture, too, and remember how all of you looked. Sometimes I see former students in town or other places, and I often don't recognize them, but they know who I am. I look about the same, only gray and wrinkled and old. <laughs> Time has marched on. It's been 22 years since I retired, but I think of Rose School often. It was part of my life for 33 years, and yes, I'm 77 now. Wow. We moved over here to Langlois the same year that I retired. It's a good place to be, small community, good friends, a mile or so inland from the ocean so that there isn't the constant wind that seems to blow out there. I live about a quarter mile off Highway 101 just across from Langloy Market. Am I saying that right, Langloy? Yeah, Lang that's right. Market, and up the hill, third house on the right. <laughs> if you're over here and have time, stop in. The operetta, the field trips, and all the mischief we got into were so much fun. Uh, were you guys in class when Tsetse and Tiffany, the dogs, used to come to school? I don't think we could get by with that now. <laughs> My family has grown so that I now have seven grandchildren ranging in age from 16 to 23. The two youngest are in high school, four are in college, and one is married and is expecting my first great-grandchild. That's pretty exciting to me. I have a few hobbies and I read a lot, plus play the organ for our church here in Langway. Tell everyone I said hi and have a wonderful reunion day. Sincerely, Joanne, or Mrs. Powell. <laughs> I didn't know her name. 